the wall is down and the battle is beginning. And even if I'm nitpicking because I'm trying to make how to be the most efficient at war right now. It's fine. It's fine. Dusselvolt got it. We don't need a Dragon Breath deck. Dusselvolt MVP along with Dakira. One of the four Heavenly Blades. The other three trash still. They're just filler to pad up the 31, you know, Integrity Knights. But Dusselvolt and Dakira truly went all out. Rest in peace, Dakira. Eltree is a fucking living L. What are they doing with that character, bro? Straight up. Eltree ain't doing shit. He's constantly just shitting on Kirito for, I guess, some valid reasons. But even in the battlefield, he sucks. Renly is literally taking his shit, ran away. The two girls, the lolly girls that stabbed Yuji and Kirito before, they got excited that Kirito is a fucking vegetable and went to the back lines as well. And Alice is collecting sacred resources. And the sacred resources is people dying? Like, when people die, they're like, they like turn into golden glitter. And like, Alice is like collecting all that shit. I don't remember any mechanic that allows her to do this, but she is special, right? And she's like creating this fucking spirit bomb. Even if the first round of combatant has been dispatched, the mountain flatland goblins with the giants, they're kind of fucking elves, to be honest. The real opponents have yet to be shown yet. And there was that really interesting thing where the monster felt fear when Fanatio did her thing. And because a monster should not feel fear, the flux light, it just, just started to go out of control and then he started to glitch everywhere. That was pretty interesting in terms of the plot relevance, right? Let's begin to this reaction. Eldrie, bro. More Eldrie. The fucking smoke bomb. Oh, the kids! Let's go! These tiny ass kids just slitting throats. Rally's taking a shit! Damn! D did she just cut his dick off? No, it looked like it. It looked like it. I thought it did. That was a face shot. Ooh. Renly, what are you doing? Yo, Renly better be like a super cracked person that just is very afraid. So when you can get over this, like, I don't know, like mental block, maybe Renly will pop up and we'll get a redemption arc. Stigma of the disqualified. Probably Renly. Renly is the disqualified one, right? Because he fucking ran away. What are you doing, bro? That's fucking sad. That's how Randy. useless you are. <gasps> Quinella! Oh, she's back! First time seeing Quinella in season four. Coward, aren't you? Coward. System Chud. This fucking guy. I love Chud. I do. Wait, 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 wait. It seems I have no choice but to sentence you to cryostasis. Okay, you can just, Quinella's like, this is a defective product. I'm just gonna throw you out. Double winged blades. Double wings? Can't even use Shikara Bankai. Damn, Renly, you're that useless? <laughs> Fucking Chud. I have to suck her toes like 20 times for her to say goodnight to me. You're so lucky. <laughs> <laughs> oh, Chud. Like, I unironically do enjoy Chud. I am a Chudolkin enjoyer. Because, <laughs> first of all, he is like the perfect, like, comical fucking justice to Quinella. Because she's someone that is supposed to be a being so deep within her own vein, right? She's all superficial and beauty and everything. But, like, her the ending with Chud was just like a poetic fucking ending. And Chud's low-key kind of cute. He's entertaining. He kind of cute. He's a fucking menace. He's ridiculous, but it's fun when he's on the screen. Fuck. Chud is cute, bro. Straight up. The kids. The kids. Kids gonna get Renly out? So hold on. This Renly guy was frozen or petrified by Chud because, you know, it's a fucking failure. Can't even use perfect control arts. So that's why in season 3, Renly was pretty much not even there. Plot reason. And now that Quinella's gone and we need more knights, Renly was 
unpetrified and now is like going to the battlefield, but he's fucking useless. Got it. Oh, it's T Saint Roni. Wait! Y'all leave Kirito's wheelchair out there? Wait, 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 wait. Th those two brought Kirito to the fucking back lines and they just. <laughs> they went back with this Kirito here? They better have brought Kirito. They brought up. They better have brought Kirito, bro. <laughs> I'm not a knight. Pussy. Yeah, they're all dead because of you. That's true, at Alright, so this is how Renly will get his motivation back. By witnessing Kirito, who is a current vegetable, but even he still has the willpower to maybe even protect or fight, he will be motivated, and Renly will figure out a way to overcome his fears? Yep. The one that destabilized this entire place. Hmm? Yeah, that's why you dragged into the fucking battlefield? Now what? You want Renly to protect Kirito? Renly's gonna run away first before defending Kirito. What are you gonna what do you mean? I don't think this is a good idea. Okay. Oh shit. Uh oh They coming! Them goblins are coming! Oh fuck. It's because the fucking left part, like the left partition that Renly and Elder were fucking supposed to be responsible for just got obliterated. Now they're literally at our tents? Oh! <laughs> What? Some white Iom girl. So Iom. We know that Iom is like pretty much a slur for like the other people on the other side, but white Iom girl? They're they white? Roni and Tisei? I mean, yeah, I think they are. <laughs> they, they, they do have Caucasian last names, right? <laughs> this goblin's a milkman, bro. Can you blame him? Hey. Renly! Renly, do something! Double-edged blade! Backstory. This Kirito? No, I don't think so. It just really looks Maybe. like him. It is Kirito? His hair is a... It is a tournament that got off screen, but like, is this actually Kirito? It really... It looks similar, but the voice actor does not match and his hairstyle doesn't either. You guys are capping. Accidental injury. Oh, he killed? Did Renly kill? Oh, okay. So this traumatic event during a tournament where the sword shattered and this person might be killed is what's causing him to be scared to go in battle now. Holy shit. <laughs> Tisa and Roni only exist to get sexually assaulted. <laughs> this is just a fact. This is so sad. What pathetic characters. It's not even their fault. It's the fucking author, bro. What? <laughs> Come on, man. <laughs> Oh, oh, Kirito! His reflexes! His instincts! This will motivate Renly. Bro doesn't even have an arm. And he's doing this. Yes, the reflexes. And this will move Renly, right? Yeah, you pussy bitch! Do something! Now, did his friend actually die there? Anybody? System arts? Luminous element? Heal? Durability transfer, nobody? I guess his friend actually died, huh? Damn. But it doesn't count as breaking the taboo index, I guess.
Or maybe this does count, and this is how Renly was then transferred to the Axiom Church. Who knows? Oh, the soundtrack is great. Yeah. Double wing blade. What was that? That was so fast. Double wings. I don't know what that really means, but that was fast as fuck. The fuck is this? It's like a throwing knife to him, pretty much. Kirito's to his face, man. Renly, got out there. Okay. Alright, Renly's back. Poop break done. Here we go, the result is back. And is this even like enhanced armament form? I'm not sure. Dude, the projectile style is crazy. It got countered by somebody. There's a big boy. There's a big boy that countered it. Oh shit, it's the chief. Flatland mountains? Oh uh, Flatland. Flatland uh. goblins? Is Renly coming in clutch because we happen to be here as a knight when the mountain goblins invaded? Or are we simply just solving the problem that we created because we weren't able to hold down the left flank and therefore they've breached this far? <laughs> Not gonna work on this guy. I love how they like return to him. Cause like imagine this. He shot these weapons and he deflected them and then they're gone now and Renly has no weapons. Like you're getting super lucky on these fucking boomerang chakras returning to you, bro. <laughs> Yes. Well, let him cook. Release recollection. We'll see. Damn, Camilla. I will fight for Kirito and Tisa and Roni. Renly's got the ambition in his eyes. Alright. Mental image? This gay as fuck, I just realized. His power. His, his boyfriend, a double winged blade theme, the two birds flying in the air together. <laughs> Let's go! No, 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 it's gonna come back. Recollection! What does it do now? Oh shit! It combined into one single blade now, okay, four pointed. Basically destructive disc. Like, I don't think you can cut this now. I think that his weapon will be cut if this is supposed to be like a super sharp blade. Oh it maneuvers from behind. It's got a mind of its own, man. Basically, release recollection is when the two double-edged blades combine and has like autopilot and it has a mind of its own. Got it. Pretty good, Renly. Now get the fuck in the front lines. For the kids! These kids, bro. Scary kids, man. I want them to use release recollection too, if they can. We need to go save Eldri. Eldri is probably just still fucking up. Supply corpse? What? We just had those three join the supply corpse. I'm not really too sure what that means, but they were trying to do something last episode when they realized Kirito was behind, right? And they moved back, but they joined the supply corpse? But they're in the tent. Okay, where's supply corpse? This kid's putting in so much work, so, man. Renly, what about you? What are you gonna do? Also, when the fuck is Asna showing up? Yo, Asna needs to get her station account and show up! Dark territory, okay. Second group. Remember, the first group is a bunch of jokes. I still think that the mountain and flatland goblins with the titans are just a joke, right? The true group's faction that I'm scared about 
Honestly, is it Dark Mages? The Assassin Guild is pretty interesting because they immediately took down Dark Berkeley with their poison shit. And the Pugilist, right? The Martial Artist. So those dudes are looking pretty strong. Oh, Dark Mage. Okay, okay, enough of this shit. You have to remember 1 minute IRL is 16.6 hours inside. EXPLAIN TO ME HOW THE FUCK Mr. Miller and Vasago already link started when they were literally doing the same shit at the same time Asuna was going in and us saying like we have no time to spare I don't take you bro What are they still doing? What, what are they doing? Is Higa and Kikuoko like Dude, maybe we should give the Chikai the Solar account No! We got Stacy account I don't know Vasago and Mr. Miller immediately went in. I, I'm not taking that excuse. I don't care. No, no, I'm not taking that excuse. You know for a fact that they're holding Asuna until the end to have this crazy epic moment where she shows up and boosts team morale and revives Kirito, right? They're waiting for that moment. So clearly there's a plot purpose on why she's arriving late. I know that it's just fuck, girl. You gotta show up or I'm gonna have to wait like five more episodes. Life for 700 Alright, minions coming. She does not give a fuck about anything. She got a wine glass too? Oh, that... <laughs> Alright, basically the powers of the Dark Mage seems to really rely on the minions right now, but I see you. 800 minions? Oh shit, there they come. What the mouth do, man? Berkeley's ready? Wait. Berkeley is literally gonna solo this shit? Because the Human Guardian is second like unit center. Berkeley's in the front lines. I'm not sure if the men are behind here. Minions. There's like a red wall, I see. Where are our dragons at? What's that red light? There's red lights everywhere. Oh shit, he already sliced everything. He's, these are all cuts in the future. These red lights is him prepping all the slices so the minions are literally fucking dead right now. It's like a minefield they're about to come into, not trigger it. Broccoli! Fuck, she's so sick. Wait a minute. Alice, where did your spirit bomb go? Last episode, she was like... <laughs> and then it's gone now. Where'd it go? You just disappear? Okay, I... Alright, it's nighttime. Maybe it's gone for nighttime. Time splitting sword. Oh, there it is, there it is. Here's the ball. Oh, can shrink too? So I still don't really understand why she can absorb these excess resources. No, sorry. Sacred resources, which is supposed to be like the energy or life force of people that's died. And I'm sure it relates to how special Alice really is. And it's probably a spoiler, but it's just like, what the fuck? Sacred resources? Life? Dying? And she can just suck that shit up? Okay. <laughs> Mage unit, she thinks. Mage unit. One man with a sword. Oh, she's getting too tilted. Your beautiful face, lady. Come on, calm down. The dragons are still chilling. Yeah. But the Dark Knights also have their dragons. Yeah. Guess which one it was. Does it? I didn't realize this part. Using their weapons in that matter should consume a massive amount of life. I didn't realize that using perfect control arts, whether it be the release recollection or enhanced armament or even just using our divine objects 
I never knew that shit fucking consumes our life force. What the fuck? I don't remember that. The Yu-Gi-Oh versus Berkeley was specific to Yu-Gi-Oh, where the, there, the his re release recollection has two components. It was the AOE, it was the AOE freeze, but the rose is specific to Yu-Gi-Oh's move, where both the opponent and Yu-Gi-Oh's durability was being drained. This isn't a thing that everyone can do. That was specific to Yu-Gi-Oh's ultimate. I don't. I never heard of this bullshit. Yes. Are you? That's your second wine glass, bro. Is she gonna keep taking L's? Is she gonna throw this cup down too? Then there's gonna be a third wine glass? Like, what's going on? She already shattered the first one. Alright, here comes another lick with the lips, bro. Come on, give me that tongue. Good luck. I still don't believe that these dudes are ogres. These are werewolves. Fuck you, these are not ogres, man. In what fucking fantasy show have you ever seen beast people like this called ogres? Bullshit! <laughs> I know it's a war and you can't have interesting designs for everyone, but... Literally two fucking virgins copy pasted from CGI all of these dark mages. Ogres my ass! Sacred resources again! Alice just sucking this shit up. Good and bad. And only Alice can do this? No one else? Both are warm and pure, not just the humans, but the demi-humans as well. Is this to kind of tell us that like at the end of the day, there is no good or evil, you're all just artificial floodlights that's born from something pure and it just happens that you were like this? I'm, I'm not sure. Yeah, it's this philosophical debate of are we the good guys or are we the bad guys? But at the end of the day, when they both die, the souls are the same, it's the same essence. So it's just like this like... You know, debate of like, I thought they're good. I'm sorry, I thought we're good and they're bad, but how could this be the same at the core? Yeah, basically just seeing like a criminal and like an innocent person both see that they both bleed red, right? It's just like, oh, we're at the same at the end of the day, that kind of shit. Mm -hmm. The spawn point is what matters the most in life, unfortunately. Yo, Alice is about to become sentient. She's, she's asking the real questions now. Are we in a simulation? What's going on here? Amayori. They're coming! Okay. But with the sacred resources. So you're gonna do Excalibur? What are you gonna do? You got that fucking sacred resource. In a mirror and reflect them infinite. Oh shit! We're about to get some crazy laser beam. Infinitely. Huh? Because they got depleted, right? Because this was our plan to deplete the resources, a high risk, high reward where they can't use sacred arts and neither can we or something, right? Man, they really didn't do their homework. The Dark Mage girl is about to take her third fucking wine class soon. <laughs> She's gonna be so tilted. She just sent her entire forces. They and they can't even use the fucking magic, bro. System <laughs> There's no battery here left, guys. You gotta get back. Uh oh. Your sin ducks wide open. No sacred resources here. Yeah, and we're sucking it all up. We are literally yoink! Nope! It's all for me, not you! Alice's ball. Here we go! Oh shit, Alice!
Okay, that's fucking ridiculous. Holy shit. Look at the amount of the Osmanthus leaves. And then what are we gonna do? Mirror, infinite, fucking reflection, light beams, Megiddo style? Cliffhanger incoming. Burst Go. element. Oh! Now, why couldn't we have used Amayori first? Because, like, you showed me Amayori's breath attack in the earlier episodes. That shit was destructive, huh? Like, I'm, I, 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 this was fucking sick, right? But this is basically the beam attack I wanted to be happen, bro. Is the mages all dead? Yo, what happened to the mages? <laughs> Look at all these burnt up courses, and this is even more sacred resource that we can like suck up, right? Jesus, Alice. Yeah, you did all that. Wow, I'm surprised they actually fucking delivered rather than, you know, doing a cliffhanger there. But hey, we fucking finally see Alice's power. Alice has been basically just camping the entire time, waiting for people to die, and their sacred resource, their souls being sucked up. Something unique to only Alice, maybe, and this beam attack. Insanity. Absolute fucking insanity. And I hope that this is not the one time that, like, we can use this. Like, as long as people keep dying, can't Alice just continuously suck up their sacred resources and use this attack? Today's MVP definitely is Berkeley and Alice. No, Renly, I don't give a fuck about your sad backstory. I honestly don't care. It's nice that you got that shit back and your release recollection is pretty useful but i'm gonna give it to berkeley and, Ren and berkeley and alice man both of them a single person taking down entire units bro and the dark mages she is she got done dirty they hyped her up so much they hyped her up so fucking much and now is she gonna be on her third fucking wine glass what's she gonna do next i don't fucking know we'll find out next time if you're still here though if you enjoyed this reaction, please like the video, check out the other playlist for even more content, and until next time, take care.